What's up everyone, Ben Murphy here, and today I'm with this BMW M4, and I'm gonna show you how to configure the M buttons in any BMW car. So let's get into the video. So here are your M buttons right here. M1 is right there, and M2 is right there, so you can have two different sets of settings, because that's what these buttons do. These buttons basically configure settings. So I'm gonna show you how to configure these settings and how to set up the M buttons. So these are basically your three main uh, kind of driving mode areas right here. This one's for thr throttle response, this first button. The middle button is the uh, stiffness of the suspension. And the third button is the basically the tightness of the steering. So for the throttle response, we'll just put that in sport right now. It can go to efficient, sport, or sport plus. Uh, stiffness of the suspension, we'll just keep, we'll just put that in sport for now. And that can go to comfort, sport, or sport plus, and tightness of the steering, we'll just put that in sport for now. That can go into comfort, sport, or sport plus as well. And this top button is your traction control way up here. We'll just keep that on for now. Traction control is right there. And this button right here is for your kind of like your shifting modes, I would say. So you can go from one up to two and then up to three. It's basically how quick it shifts. So we'll just keep that in uh, manual mode for now and we'll put that in two. So if you hold the M button, the M1 button right here, you just hold it down like this. And then you can hear that little ding right there. That lets you know that the M car, the uh, car is, when you hit M1, will go into sport mode, automatic, and with your second shift setting, so it'll shift a little quicker than if it was in uh, number one. So, but if you want to configure this even more, you can go up here to settings. There it says settings right there on your screen. You click that. You go to M drive one, because we're working with the M1 button right now. And then as you can see, it shows all the settings. But you can do all these settings right here, but there's one you can't do, which is your heads up display view. You can put this into M view if you want, which basically shows your uh, RPM limiter up there as well as just the speed. So we'll just keep that in the default view right now. Yeah, so you can change everything. And if you wanna come here, you can change this to manual mode as well. The S means manual, and then D is automatic. So yeah, and so here's a, like a little demonstration of that. If we click M2, M2 for this car sets everything to sport plus, traction control off, manual mode, Third, the highest shifting mode, so it's just really fast. But as you can see, if we click M1, it'll take everything back to sport, back to automatic, second shifting mode like we had it. And that is how you configure the M buttons on a BMW M car. So subscribe to the channel if you want to see some more informational car content. Like the video if you liked it down below. If you liked it, drop a comment down below. Uh, if you have any more questions or any other videos you'd like to see, and I will see you guys in the next video.